And now, it's crunch time on the jump. See how excited I am? Kyrie Irving will not play Saturday when the Nets face the Lakers in Shenzhen, China. He left one minute into Brooklyn's first preseason game after aggravating his facial fracture. Paul, Ooh. Kyrie has had durability issues, particularly with the face. Can he carry the Nets all season? I don't know. Like you said, he has durability issues. And, you know, he's going to be in a situation, I think, the same as he was in Boston. So if he's not going to be healthy, um, which he hasn't been for yep. some years now, it could be a long year for them, especially since KD's not going to be there. I just can't imagine flying home 15 hours with facial fractures. Oh, my God. I, I, I ugh, you gotta take get sick for thinking that. about it. You got to take something for that. All right, next, Sierra Canyon High School basketball held media day on Thursday. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Oh, Ronnie James is a gosh, freshman. Zaire Wade is a senior. <laughs> Nick, were you aware high schools have media days? And shout out to Rosh Markazi for being there for this. Of course. Of course he was. But this doesn't surprise me at all. I think this is actually a good move, guys. Yeah? Because when you have these type of kids in your school, in your system, and you know how much media attention is going to be on him. I mean, look at this tall kid. He's getting Harold. all this national publicity for, last name? for lifting him up. The ha Harold was helping everybody, giving everybody Good a Good for Harold. Right all right. <laughs> all right. That's why. This is going to be one of the most watched high school teams ever. It's right in your neck of the woods, right? Yeah. yeah the, check them out. The Wizards are at the Knicks tonight when they played Monday. Marcus Morris was ejected after hitting Justin Anderson in the head with the ball. Nick, expect to see any beef carry over tonight? Yeah. <laughs> always. Nice. Always, always, always. Nobody forgets in the league. Everybody knows what hey, happens. Man, so. Has anyone ever my disrespected man, you like that, Paul? No, nah, not like that. Uh-uh. Never. They got a uh, rah, rah, rah man. Hit somebody in the head. See, Ron was always into some stuff like this, though. Man, I was used to this. He nope. was grabbing, pulling, but he didn't hit me upside my head. The one the one I well, remember we had a prop. was the rookie sophomore game where Jason Richardson threw the ball off Carlos Jr.'s head. That's yeah, come on. That's just flat out yeah. just come on, let's fight. <laughs> come on. Now. All right, we're, we're running out of time for the week, but let's hit one last topic. The Boston Globe reports Jalen Brown has hired an agent to handle contract extension talks. Jalen is entering his fourth season and has until October 21st to work out a deal. Paul, is there any pressure on the Celtics to give Jalen Brown a max extension? Not a max extension. I mean, when we're talking about there's no pressure on yeah. I mean, like when you got guys like we said, Ben Simmons, okay, yeah. We know this guy, he's gonna be a superstar. We don't know where what kind of player Jalen's gonna be, so there's no pressure or, or to do anything of that nature now. Let's wait and see. If he becomes an all-star this year, we'll see we'll see next summer. Nick, that extension would probably be around the 31, 32 million dollar per year average. Is he a max guy in your eyes? What's the word I'm looking for here? No. <laughs> no, oh, no, no, no. You prove it. Right. You say to yeah. Jalen, hey, look, you want to be the guy? You want all the money? Prove it. So He hasn't so. done it yet. To me, there are two types of extensions. One is, like Paul said, Ben Simmons. You lock him up quick yeah. because you know he's a star, bona fide. The other is you get a good deal now because you're worried that he might outplay that contract later. The problem with giving him a max contract now is there's no chance he can outplay it. Because that's the max you can get. Right. So if he's going to get max, you might as well wait till next summer. He's a restricted free yeah, agent. No pressure. Right. No pressure at all. All right. This just in at the buzzer. Early in the show, Paul got so animated, he knocked over his water mug. That's what Nick <laughs> lost it. He's probably just excited because it's his birthday on Sunday. Yeah. Hey, listen, my, reflex aren't, my reflexes aren't the same. I mean, I'm, I'm about to be 42 <laughs> years old. I can't. Just knocking over things now. What, what are you doing for your birthday? Um... I don't know, I'm gonna do something fun. Let's see, man. Something fun. 42? Oh, look, man. Look at this. Look at look at young Paul. <laughs> That's young Paul. That's 28. The reflexes are rolling right the there. This was good. I didn't <laughs> knock over nothing. I didn't knock nothing down but buckets. Back in the rim, though. No switches. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, man. Good times. Look, look how happy he is right there. Oh, man. Didn't knock nothing down but buckets. <laughs> <laughs> Back in the rim. No switches. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.